Now, for anyone watching this or for anyone who's read the book, who's going through a midlife crisis, yes. what advice do you have for them and what destinations do you recommend they see or what activities do you recommend they do to help them get over this hump? Um, the thing is, it doesn't actually matter where you go. Um, it's because wherever you go, it's always slightly disappointing. Mm -hmm. um, oh, well, that's... <laughs> It's no, a little if, you, if you're in the throes, well, actually, that is that is in fact true. Um, uh, I, won't, I don't like to say that too often because it's it's it's, it's not nice to disillusion the young. <laughs> um, but like wherever you go, it's, it's always it's it's always in in retrospect that it was nice. Mm -hmm. Like for me, or maybe it's maybe it's just me. But during holidays, I never really like it that much. I travel a lot, but I never really like it when I'm on the ground. Um, I'm always I'm worried about money, or I'm worried about like, oh, am yeah. I having a good enough time, or you know, should I do this, or should I do that later? You know, when should I do? Uh, when I get home and I think about the holiday, man, it was great, and I suddenly re realize how beautiful it all looks and what fun I had, and I was happier then than I could ever be again, you know. But it's never that way at the time. So, so for me, it doesn't really matter where you go or what you do. It's the thing to look forward to is your memories of it. That's a good way to put it. Yeah. Because as you it's said like life, that, actually. Yeah. As you said that, um, it's actually true. Mm, I believe so. Mm. And I think that's like life. Like it's, 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 it sucks, uh, life, right? <laughs> Except when you look back and go, oh, my 30s. Like, I didn't really enjoy my 30s. Mm. But I think back, oh, 30s, that was a good time. That was so beautiful. Look how free I was. Look how slim, you know. So I'm looking forward to my 50s. I can look back on my 40s and go, oh, that was, that was really good I guess good in time. comparison, right, yeah, when you look yeah. back. Like 70-year-olds are always saying, oh, if only I could be 60 again. Mm. You know? But no one who's 40 is thinking, oh, I really want to be 60. It's going to be an awesome decade. Yeah. <laughs> uh, look, uh, you know, I'm, I'm hoping in 20 years' time we'll all have jetpacks and hoverboards and, and 60 will be the new 25, but without the 25-year-old problems. Mm. But no, but that's the thing. I think I think looking back on stuff, that's that's where the pleasure is in life. All right, Daryl, where can anyone watching this video who hasn't already read your book pick it up? Um, it, it, any decent bookstore, I should think. Um, although it's, it's sold out in quite a few bookstores, okay. so I, I go to, personally, I go to Kalahari com or Takealot dot com or any one of those internet uh, places because uh, there's nothing more irritating than these damn bookstores who, who order them five at a time, sell out, and then mm. you can't get, can't get hold of them mm. again. All right, well, if you... The hell with you bookstores. <laughs> if you've already read Daryl's book, let us know what you thought of it in the comments section below this video.